Good evening, sports fans! Crowbat for the win of the Token Minorities here today with Season 8, Week 10 of the NPL against Greg, Gregulator. Now, this is definitely an interesting game because I am pretty much eliminated from the playoffs at this point, and it makes me very sad considering I thought we were going to have a really good run. And unfortunately, just a few lousy matchups, a couple misplays along the way, just stuff like that kept us out of it. And it's, it's not my lack of trying. I put so much effort into all these teams, including this one, by the way. This was, I thought, a well-thought-out team as well. Uh, but at this point, we're just going to play for a very, very fun game and hope that we can get a victory, because I'd love to go 500 here. That would just be amazing. So let's just see what he has on his side of the field. He is Barbarical, Charizard X, Landorus, and, uh, Therian, Raikou, Rotom, Wash, and Scizor. Now, just in case you forgot my team of Jamokes from the Team Builder, we've got Mega Gyarados, Kabalion, Lantern, Landorus Eye, Tornado Therian, and Mammal Swine. Now, just as a quick reminder, I will not have fun sports clips and, and uh, in interactive stuff in this upload. It makes me sad that I can't, but I have final exams and I'm about to get crushed next week, so I need to study. And that's kind of more important than spending five hours doing that stuff. However, I have a big announcement that will be coming soon, and that will, I think, more than make up for the fact that these last two weeks have not had the quality that I want with, with respect to sports clubs and stuff. So, stay tuned for that. That's going to be coming soon. Alrighty, let's jump into this game. So, I'm going to lead off with Tornado Therian as he leads off with the Landorus Therian. I get a crit hurricane turn one with a confusion. Now. He does get a rock tomb off, which is pretty annoying, but you know what, that thing's at such low health. I was really hoping that, you know, obviously the, um, the, I was hoping that he'd get confused, but he didn't, so he sets the Brox as I go into Landers Incarnate to just U-turn and KO that thing. So it goes down! So it's looking pretty good for me off turn one. Now, I thought Mega Charizard X was coming in, but I went to Cobalion just so I can get a Volt Switch off, get a little bit of chip damage. Here's Mammal Swine, which I know should be able to take anything, except there's a crit on the screen, and that made me really sad. I could not believe he got a crit. I don't think they would have KO'd. I had some good bulk investment in that Mammal Swine, and it's unfortunate. I mean, Wits rocks up as well. I really didn't have too many options there, because something would have definitely died. Or if he sat, set up, I was in big trouble. He could have said maybe I could have gone to Lantern. Not really, because first of all, if he set up, he would have just KO'd me with Earthquake the next turn. Second of all, he probably would have just KO'd me with Earthquake next turn. So, either way, it really didn't matter. That was kind of my only play. I was hoping to just get an Ice Shard off and do big damage after, hopefully, the Flare Bits recoil, but it's unfortunate. Let's go on in the game. So here's Mega Gyarados. I get the Intimidate off, which is nice. I have to go for the Mold Breaker Earthquake, and it actually hits the Rotom for big damage, which was awesome. I'm gonna switch into Lantern, because I'm not wanting to get burned by Rotom or have any shenanigans go on. I go to Lantern to Volt Switch out on the Scizor. Now, he U-turns as I go to Tornadus Therian, so I can hopefully defog these rocks away, but he goes to the Raikou, and that means I do not want to defog any rocks away. He Volt Switches on my Lantern. That's gonna bring some new life into Lantern, put him back in full health, which is so awesome, and I just accidentally restarted the game. So we're gonna just zoom on ahead. Alright, we're here. So he sets up a light screen after that, and I Volt Switch out. So this is gonna be a big pain. He has a dual screens Raikou, or at least one screen Raikou, I guess. That's crazy. Oh man, so I'm just gonna Volt Switch out with my Cobalion against the Mega Charizard X. Now here is Landorus Incarnate. I don't feel comfortable just going for Earth Power because I can't, I mean, I do there because I figured the Rotom was the switch, but I mean like, I don't feel comfortable that I can sweep with Earth Power yet because I need to make sure that that Scizor is below about 70% health. So I, I am not in a range where I can sweep. He does get a Toxic off on my Lantern, but he can't do anything because I have Heal Bell, and Hydro Pump does absolutely nothing. So I'm just going to Volt Switch, hope it does good enough damage, it'll be a 2 hit KO if I come back in again. Now I'm hoping that Volt Switch KOs this thing, and really it doesn't, it was a stretch to say. I hope maybe he goes for the bait again with the Volt Switch, and he does! So Lantern is getting more health back, and then he misses the Toxic as I Volt Switch again. This is going so well so far. All right. Now that that thing's gone, I almost safely can lock myself into Earth Power, but I just need that scissor down to a little bit less health before I can do anything. 
he who turns out. I go to Kabalian. Now he goes to the Charizard as I close combat it. I'm hoping it would do enough damage, but it really doesn't. It does KO after the Flare Blue Tree Coil, though, and that was honestly the goal. At that point, I would have been totally cool with that. Now here, Lantern versus Scizor. I just Volt Surge out. I need to just get that chip damage so that Landorus Incarnate could possibly win the game from here. He goes to the Raikou on the Torianus. I'm just going to U-turn out. I'm going to get my Regenerator so I can go back into rocks again, thankfully. Now he sets up that light screen again, and that is going to be so annoying. And I see that Barbarical in the back, and I'm starting to feel really scared. I go for the Aqua Tail, just in case he decides to set up a sub. I really don't want to Volt Switch out. So he Bullet Punches, which is fine. I Aqua Tail again. And now here, I really should have Volt Switched. I should have expected Barbarical here, and I don't know why I didn't. He is gonna go to the Barbarica, which is on a balloon. So you know what? I wouldn't have been able to. Have, I wouldn't have been able to sweep with Landorus Incarnate, anyways. So my game plan really wouldn't have worked, anyways. So that's interesting. Uh, the balloon pops, but it really doesn't matter because he's gonna have low kick. And guess what? Surprise, surprise! Barbarical is going to sweep late game, and there is absolutely nothing that I can do. And it's a disappointment for sure, but why don't we just put an end to this season right now with a poison jab to the face. That was a, ga a game that was a lot closer than it looked, I think. It really came down to like one or two plays at the end. I should have Volt Switch there. I didn't expect Barbarical to be on a balloon. Like, just, uh, that's crazy, but it worked for him. Good for him. You know, he, all he did was out prep me by just half a hair. Half of a hair, and I, if he didn't have something like that, I could have had that game. But there's not much that I can do now. It is what it is. We're gonna be four and six to end the season, and uh, I'll probably just post a wrap up next weekend after my finals are over, just to uh, talk about the season sort of thing and where we go from here. I'm hoping I can announce my good news at that time, but if I can't, I'll just do uh, a wrap up for this. So anyway. Thanks for watching, guys, this whole season. I know there have been a lot of ups and downs, but I think there has been a lot of positive, despite what it might seem with our, neg our negative record, our less than 500 record. I still think there were very many positives to this season. That's for sure. And, um, yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. I think I'm ready to wrap up. Great comments, sub to TTM, guys, and peace out.